Any idea on him? No, none. We both work for large agencies. Sometimes information doesn't travel as fast as it should. You should have been notified. Call that number. This is one of our supervisors. here to step on your toes. We're all here to do the same thing. Nobody knows what really happened. Until we find out, there will be no determination of what information or details can be exchanged. Slow. Yes, sir. On my way. That was my supervisor. I've been notified. Sir, set up shop at the shooting range. I'll meet y'all there. You two put eyes on rapid air. So you want us to verify the nuke's still there? It's still there. Lynch isn't going anywhere until he figures out a way around the Molnia. There is no way. Well, we're the way around it. He just doesn't know that yet. <laughs> Whoever was running Marcus has to try to contain the damage now. If I'm gonna find Adel and I sort of need to know who he is, he's gonna send another team in here to see what happens, so I really gotta talk to him if I can. some folks right now, see if you can cover my six.
Don't move. We can do this the easy way or the hard way. Drop that rifle. Put your hands up and move it back. Backwards, 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 backwards. Who sent you? If I tell you, you're not going to kill me? I won't. You have my word. Magellan. This is code name. That's all I know. <laughs> Yeah, I caught that too. Hang on a second. The boats are up. What, here? The entrance is here? Okay. Well, it'd be nice to know what we're looking for. No. All information I have is that the CIA guy, Marcus Mitchell, that got killed, he's got some tie to this boat, the Yellowfin. Kane, another player just showed up. Looks like cops. Get out of there. Don't fall out here. Yeah, I'll let you know. What I want to know is what's the CIA guy doing in Seattle getting so shot. You got me. Come on, let's get this over with. All right, I'll take a look. Just hang out here. Keep an eye out for me. I'm not going to get my ass shot, too. As long as it gets me where I'm going, I'm fine. So how do you know Kane? Africa. We did a few ops together. Yeah, Africa. Good guy to have watching your back. Yeah, that's true. Not a lot going on here. Hey, 
Castillo. You should be aware. We've got FBI getting up on us now, so watch out. Copy that. You got any movement where you are? We got one guy in the loading dock. The rest are holed up inside. Not sure if Lynch is here or not. I guess they're trying to figure out their next place. Just hold tight. We have to move it. You want to move that thing? Be my guest. I'll be outside. What else can we do? We move it, we die. We don't move it, we don't die. Don't say we. One more goddamn time. I want to put a bullet in your head. You understand me? That bitch reprogrammed the codes. I know she did. I'm not touching that. I'm out of moves. My contacts are all dead. Yeah. Using this phone, you can connect to the man himself. I still got one. You have entered the remote access. VPN. S1212. One, two, one, two. You paranoid son of a bitch. Pick up the goddamn phone. Your call will be returned. Clear. It's a shame about the yellow pin. She's starting to get my sea legs. This isn't so bad. I'll give you a chance to work in your target practice. As long as I'm not the target. We're running out of time. You got something better to do, Devlin? Sit, Rep. All clear. I don't like it. It's quiet. It's quiet. It shouldn't be quiet. The goddamn forest is quiet, Devlin. This isn't the goddamn forest of the city. Cities aren't quiet. Yeah. Lynch. Who's this? Who's with you? I'm with Devlin. Where's my package? The first device got damaged in transport, but I recovered the trigger, so we have all the components for a working device. You have the wrong trigger. My delivery requires all original components. The serial numbers need to match. So what do you want us to do, sir? I have the necessary component. I need you to deliver the package. No more cutouts. You just got promoted. The package is wrapped up in ammonia. We can't touch it. Yeah, that Russian alpha. You need to find Kane. With all due respect, sir, I'm not following the logic. The Russian is with Kane. So get the Russian, and where's Kane? He's looking for the only person that can lead him to me. Marcus's handler. Codename Magellan. He's hiding out in a safe house. Kane will find it, so that's where you'll find Kane. I'll send you the coordinates. We just leave the package here. Kane knows where it is. Don't you think maybe his people will come and grab it while we're gone? I'm counting on it. So we leave the package here, and we go find Kane. What then? Kane needs the package as much as I do now. He knows it, and I know it. If you leave the package behind, his team will disarm the Monia. Transport the device to Kane. He'll deliver it to Magellan. Magellan will lead you to Kane. Problem. Why would there be a problem? Exactly.
Well, I think by virtue of the fact that you showed up really tells me something. Do you know an operator named Magellan? Never heard of him. But I wanted you to know there have been some major operations going on here in Seattle. And at the company, it looks like they've got your M.O. all over them. Is this you? I mean, I can't really help you with that, but I always have sanction for everything I do. That's what I figured. Can't give you any direct help, but is there anything I can do for you? Keep a finger on the feds. Yeah. The FBI might give you trouble, but don't worry, Kane. We'll do what we can. I appreciate that. So this is Hassan's phone, and this was Marcus's phone. Hassan sent out a signal right at the time he called the madam. It was a GPS location, kind of like a distress call, right? Yeah, because this boy showed up right after. Now, that signal went out to one other location. Marcus's phone. 45 seconds after Hassan's GPS beacon went out, Marcus made a call to this number. It's to a phone registered in Texas that up until that night had been inactive for five months. Yeah, I had lawns. People use clean phones. They do one call and then dump them. Right. So in the days leading up to Marcus's death, he made several calls to different numbers, all to different phones that had been inactive for some time and triangulate to that same location. Adlon's location. <laughs> no, not Adlon. He's more careful than that. But we've been taking out his inner circle. Well, maybe he doesn't have anyone left to run interference for him. Or maybe he thought he didn't need to be so careful because you we're the one that was going to get cut out next. I've been trying to explain to you guys from the beginning, Adelon is a very, very intelligent operator. His main MO is to minimize his risk. Marcus was contacting his handler, Magellan. What was the location you came up with? Um, it's right here. It's a warehouse on Clark. That's probably Magellan's safe house. And hopefully that'll lead us to Adelon. Find any more phone numbers on Marcus's phone that might lead us to Magellan? Uh, yeah. I'll pull them up. Yes. Magellan. Who is this? Well, I think you probably know who it is, don't you? Well, I know it's not Marcus. Oh, well, you want to play games? It's okay if you want to play games. Maybe we should start working together rather than against each other. But unfortunately, we have different agendas. But obviously, we each have something the other guy wants. Probably it'd be best to not talk on the phone. So I think I'm gonna come by there, pay a visit. We'll chat face to face. A visit? I look forward to that. find you here. I just found something interesting. Is that right? Yeah. Seems there's been a lot of bodies showing up lately. A lot of bodies. Mostly foreign nationals with heavy military experience. That is a lot of bodies. Yeah, so what the hell's going on? All I can tell you is that he's one of our operators. He's not off book. He's covert. And that's all we know. I see it, we're gonna get cut out just like everybody else. You sure? I was supposed to cut out Eddie. King's boys took care of that for me. That's how I line work, Stefan. <laughs> You're not making me feel better. I'm not trying to. I'm gonna ask you a question, Stefan. I want you to think about your answer very carefully. orders to cut me out? No. I said think about it carefully. No. So now, interestingly enough, we have the FBI sort of sniffing around us, which is baffling beyond belief. So does that mean we're going to have to dump the vehicles? 
No, no, no. We got clean place. We can do all of that the way we need to do. What about the nuke? You guys don't really know this because I normally wouldn't discuss it with you, but I choose my operations and I get approval from the five slash coordination group. Their job is to set up a situation where none of the internal covert operations collide. By virtue of the fact that we're having this kind of scrutiny from the FBI, probably goes back to Marcus. Why don't you guys catch up with Johnny and Castillo, retrieve the package, bring it to me, and Anna will give you guys the Monio codes. Great. You know what I think? I don't care what you think, Devil. This is crap. That's why. We got movement. We're done with this. Get rid of it. James, they're on the move. Sarah know the drill. They'll get you up to speed. You got it. Do you know this Magellan? Never met him, but I know the type. He thinks he's safe sitting behind a desk, but he's not. Maybe he'll be a bit soft. <laughs> He's a thinker. That's the only thing we have to watch out for. You leave anyone behind? Only three operators left the building. One of them was Lynch. The Molnia codes just came in. All right, I'll take the perimeter. Great. Have fun. this wrong and the ammonia blows it won't set the nuke off right yeah that's right it just destroys the device and me and probably you oh good to know
Marcus Mitchell's got a connection to this place. Looks like somebody else is already here. We got company. Two targets taking a hard look at the place. Steel, was it Lynch? Check the truck. Negative. FBI. Looks like they're going in. Come on, guys, let's move this along. They're right there. Sarah, hurry up. We're about to be busted. It takes a while for the Molnia to accept the codes. We have to wait for it to cycle through. Steel, we need more time up here. They're in. They're in. Think he's gonna try to burn us? For sure. A guy like Mitchell, he's trying not to leave anything to chance. If we walk out of there, he loses control, so he'll try everything in his power to make sure we don't. Can't wait. I already told you I think you're making a mistake. And what do you know? I know what it's like on the ground. While you sit behind this fancy little desk of yours with all that paperwork in front of you. And all that does is get in the way. Well, why don't you help me out, Lynch? Spell it out for me. You can't give Kane the package. Kane owns the Moya. He owns the device. It's not a tough call. I know how to break the sequence of the Molnia. I just need you to help me buy some time. It's not about deactivating it, Lynch. Even if you did, we still have a problem here. You think I don't know that? You think I don't know that Kane is a problem? Look, I can handle Kane. He's outside right now with that Russian. Waiting for you to come in here and tell me that he's the only one that could deactivate it. And then he's gonna shove that down my throat. His agenda, his terms, his payoff. You're right. That's exactly what he's gonna do. And I have two objectives. Get the device and kill Kane. And guess what? He's helped me do both of those. Well, my advice? Don't mess with him. You let Kane run his game, and you salvage what you can on the other side. <laughs> you army boys. That's why we never win any wars anymore. One minute. We don't have a minute. He's here. Magellan is expecting you. Follow me, please. Stay here.
pleasant surprise. Please, come on in. Please have a seat. Yes, sir. After you. You're the guy that was working markets, huh? Is that what you think? Well, that's kind of what I know. But I'm really here to talk to you about Adelon. What do you think he uh, wants the bomb for? He wants information. It involves the Middle East that's sensitive. That's all I know. Mm -hmm. It's all in the SD card that Marcus prepared. SD card? I don't know what the information is. It was encrypted, so I couldn't get to it. Marcus ran the operation. I protected him inside the company. But he's at the top of the column. What do you now want the device for? Come on. You know I can't tell you that. So I guess if that's the case, the question then becomes, how badly do you want it? It's our number one objective, to obtain that device at all costs. At all costs. See, the problem is then that I now have the device, so we're going to have to, uh, as we say in the Deep South, talk turkey. OK, Kane. How do we move forward from here? I'll tell you what, you give me Eidolon, I'll give you the bomb straight up. Eidolon has a trigger for the device. I still need that. I think the way it's going to work out is I'll give you the device in exchange for the SD card. You set up a meet with Eidolon, and I will swap the card for the trigger. I'll give you what you want. You give me what I want. When do I get the trigger? As soon as I get Eidolon. FBI, drop your weapon. Put it down now. I will shoot. Put it down. Listen to me. Just put it down. I will shoot you. Slowly. Slowly. Step away. Listen step to me. Away. Let me step back. Back. Who's that? What is that? What is that thing? What is she doing? What are you doing? Step away. Step away from that, both of you! Step away from it! Step away! What did you do? What is that thing? What did you do? Smith! Smith, where the hell are you? Step away! Just let me explain. Shut up! You shut up! Step away, both of you! Smith! You know the drill. We didn't get to finish what we started. Shame about the taser burns that take so long to heal. How's your ear? That's right. You don't have. One. Don't worry about your face. Somebody someday will find you pretty again. You want to go? Hmm? Let's see how you do without your three boys there to protect you. Somebody talk to me. You need backup? The steel, we've got the package. We're on our way out. You got it. You're the good guys. Let's get out of here before the French show up. Unacceptable. Well, that's how we're gonna set it up. Your call. The 
the mail came in. I have a package. There's a letter here for you. Let me know you want to get it. Light a line, I'll get the message. He'll send for details and locations for the meeting. There'll be no direct contact. He will not deliver the trigger personally. Oh, that's cool. Wait for my call, set up a meeting in your vicinity, and uh, we'll make it happen. We have a deal? Yeah, I think so. Yes? He's coming down. I want you to overpower him and sedate him. We're gonna get the bomb ourselves. And yes, you can kill the Russian. Kane's on his way down. I'll see you up. get hurt. <laughs> Apologize about that, King. You know, my guys get a little ahead of themselves sometimes. But you know how the company is. We can't leave anything to chance. I need the trigger and a device. Guaranteed. I can't just go on your word. You don't know who to trust. That's the problem. You see, you screw the people who are really on your side. Well, we're all human. We make mistakes. Let's just see if we can pick up where we left off. Wait for my call. Let's do this again. Okay, guys, we're on our way back to you. See you in five. How'd it go, boss? You guys run into any trouble at Rapid Air? Yeah, the FBI hit us. Two guys. It looked like they were checking the place out, maybe got a tip. Yeah, but they didn't know what they were looking for. They didn't even recognize the nuke when they saw it. So they're after us, they just don't know why. Yeah, yet. You guys get ID'd? Yeah, we couldn't shoot them, so it was a little unavoidable. 
they didn't make you steal them. It's desperate times. It's either us or them. You guys know what to do.